Meta's chief, Mark Zuckerberg, lay out his plans for personal superintelligence. Madison always on the story. He spent billions poaching top AI talent. Is it paying off? I mean, you could say I so. Guess. Yeah, <laughs> I would say yes. The stock jumped over 11% after the company reported strong Q2 results yesterday. CEO Mark Zuckerberg says AI helped the company unlock greater efficiency in gains, aka profits, in advertising, so it's already working. But the social media company now has their set sight on super intelligence, and they're paying upwards of nine figures, so over a million dollars, to poach top AI talent from OpenAI, Apple, Google. Zuckerberg is personally recruiting and building this team. We are building an elite, talent-dense team. They are all incredibly talented leaders, and I'm excited to work closely with them and the world-class group of AI researchers and infrastructure and data engineers that we're assembling. Down to my left. So leading the super intelligence lab is Alexander Wang, who agreed to join Meta after they invested $14.3 billion in his previous company, Scale. Zuckerberg says artificial super intelligence is now within reach. His vision includes a future with personalized AI assistants that help you be more efficient. Part of his vision includes your literal vision. He thinks wearables like glasses are going to drive this innovation. Investors say that nine-figure salaries, which 100 million, thank you, uh, <laughs> per person, mind you, they sound like a lot, but these are researchers and developers that can deliver huge returns. That makes their salaries a bargain. The impact of a person who can create or develop an algorithmic improvement to suddenly move a company back onto the vertical part of that S-curve might be worth a few hundred billion dollars in market cap. So paying somebody $75 million a year when they could produce a thousand X more in market cap, it's a great deal. A great deal. Whoa. And this is not just an AI talent war. Meta is also increasing their capital expenditures on things like data centers, going all in there, 66 to $72 billion CapEx. So it's an AI war on all fronts, talent and infrastructure. What do you think, Adam Johnson? It's just another uh, capital expenditure, an investment. I mean, if they hire 10 people for $100 million each, that's a billion. Well, uh, Microsoft is spending $10 billion this quarter on AI. So it's just, you know, that's one, so 10 times more. So it's just another way to uh, invest in your company. And then there's Apple. And then there's yeah. Apple, right? They have put, Meta's poached yeah. their employees. Apple might have to buy AI and the or stock, buy a company right, Meta AI. stock is now up $84 a yeah. share. Buy it's it. gained ground as we've been on the air. Buy it. Madison, thanks very much indeed. All right, uh, and thank you for sticking around. Oh, Good stuff.